I wanted to share with you the Postbook app on the iPhone or the Android. I've had many requests as to how it works on this system too, and I feel it works great. Sorry for the blurriness factor. I didn't realize my camera was out of focus uh, when I did this. But as you can see, you can flip the features really quick. If you want to do the same thing with the pictures, go back and forth. You can flip it to create different uh, views to help you drawing. It scrolls the exact same way. You can zoom in and pinch out and get nice and close and see all the details. Again, I apologize for the blurriness. And you can again hit the flip button to change the angle if you want to draw from the left to the right side on there. The video function on here plays just as well. You can watch the videos and see what I'm demonstrating and again here if you want to practice hands so having it at this size is really great and beneficial too because you're able to just carry it around with you in your pocket and draw whenever you like or whenever you're feeling inspired or uninspired and you want to get better and here I have silhouettes that I've drawn doing the same thing so you can zoom in zoom out have fun with it and that's what this whole pose book is really all about here I just want to show you um, something that I do quite often is sometimes I'm in the middle of recording videos and I'm teaching or working on freelance projects but what I like to do is just pull this out and sometimes just to draw something completely different so it, it works really well to where you're able to zoom in to where you want to and you don't have to worry about all the details in the drawing at this point if I want to I could pinch in and zoom if I wanted to get a little bit more close to detail but the main goal what I'm really trying to achieve is to just really help me loosen up this is a really the apps purpose is a loosen you up type of purpose to where you can just scroll through it and find again an image that inspires you but maybe you struggle drawing just different tilts, different angles, or there may even be poses in there that you go, ooh, that one doesn't, looks hard to draw. That's your job is then to tackle it and try to draw it and see what you can get from it and draw it over and over again until you get it right. So as I go through these, these are just known as the quick gestures and this is what I'm just trying to do to help me loosen up sometimes even before I start an actual project. I did this video because I wanted just to showcase that and this was actually right before I filmed it for me just right before I was about to work on a uh, project so I can blow it up zoom in zoom out I want to make it more cartoony but looking at the exaggeration just to get an idea of oh that would be a good expression to put on my character if say I'm doing a model pack or could be anything and then I can start just character designing it and creating any sort of look and feel that I want with the character and that's real essential too is not just to rely on the reference as is but use it to help benefit you Maybe I want to pinch in on the eye and get a better understanding of how to draw a human eye. So that's how Posebook works for Android and iPhone.